I told you, maybe I was wrong about you, Philip. How could you do that? Oh, piss on you. They're coming. We need to move now. It makes no sense. Why would the Earl of Shiring do this? Shut up, or they will kill us all. It's them. Shh. Look at him. He did quite well. He got pretty far. There was someone here with him. Hugh is right. They might be close by. We should make haste. We got what we came for. Not yet. <laughs> Walter, why do I get the feeling you're upset? We didn't have to do this. We came for the saint. They deserved it. Like this ugly bastard. Kingsbridge defied us for the last time. That monk, the bitch, and the bastard she's fucking. <sighs> Come on, move! After him! But William said... I said move! My little cub! Are you alright? Did you see Aliena? She was in the market. I heard William calling out her name. Jack, come! We must find her and Jonathan. Dear God. Oh. Oh. No. Aliena. Aliena! Jonathan! He took everything from me again. Aliena! No matter what you do, no matter where you go, I will find you. Every time you think you are safe, every time you play house, I will find you. And I will crush you. Now, kill them all and make her watch. <laughs> Aliena, are you all right? I swear by Almighty God and Jesus Christ and all the saints that I will take care of my brother Richard until he has fulfilled his vow. Can't you hear me? Jack, it's all gone. I can't support Richard like this. What am I going to do now? Tom. Oh, God. No. <clears throat> we must ask the bishop for help. The bishop? Are you mad? I heard he is behind this. Shh! How? How can we go on living in Kingsbridge now? Will the cathedral still be built? Not without the market. It, it, it must be, or there'll be no work for us. Please. Our prior will answer all of your questions. 
<laughs> Philip, they are waiting for you. <sighs> yes. Can we stay in Kingsbridge? Or must we move on? <clears throat> Too many people have died. Many were injured. Among the dead is Tom Builder. No. He died protecting our little Jonathan. For which I will be eternally grateful. Tom Builder is dead. What will happen to our cathedral now? Three of our brothers have perished. Brother Arnaldus. And Brother Milius. He rests by Cuthbert's side now. We have also lost Brother Marcus, and eight more lives were taken. Will the Earl of Shiring be judged for what he did? He must be! Yes, he must! What about the saint? Where is the saint? Adolphus will protect us. It would be better if you answer their questions. Please tell us what to do. <clears throat> the rumors you have heard are true. The remains of St. Adolphus were stolen from this crypt. Oh, we are doomed. The saints are oh. talking. Was it the Earl of Shiring? Why would he do that? Milius died to protect the saint. I saw it. Is he not well? He looks pale. Brother Andrew is overseeing the repairs. And we will be able to continue the construction of our cathedral. Tom Builder's son, Alfred, will take over the position of Master Builder. Though it will take longer, for we will not hold a market again. And I am happy to welcome a new novice. Most of us are familiar with him, so I'm sure we all can share the sentiment that he will be very welcome in our Priory. Jack. As was Tom's wish. Why were we attacked? Was that really the Earl of Shiring? He will answer your questions, all of them. Tell us this what will happen with us. Attack. With Kingsbridge. Shall I continue for you, my prior? No. This attack was a great tragedy. I cannot think of why anyone would do that to us. It is impossible to grasp how these men could just... You went against the Earl of Shiring! He said you defied him! Philip was in the right. We had a market license. Our prior was in the right, but we all knew what kind of man William Hamley is. <laughs> Defiance will only lead to more grief. I... 
I agree. You should be more careful. We must never again hold a market. No. No, we must not. The Earl stole the safe because of Philip. But it's not his fault, is it? They all had to die for the market. Why is he not answering? Please answer! Why is he not saying anything? How will we go on? Why is God doing this to us? Answer them? <laughs> no. I cannot give you confidence. The stories of how God tested the faith of his followers. I see now how true they are. I think you do as well. I am asking myself, where is God? Why did he not prevent all this? I do not know. One day, God said to Satan, Look at my man Job. There's a good man if ever I saw one. So Satan said, You've given him everything. That's why he's a good man. But God said, Even if he were to lose everything he has, his faith in me would not falter, and I will prove it to you. You will burn in hell for this. What? I defeated your greatest enemy. It was a holy mission. It's not up to you to decide that. Even your father would not have been that foolish. I am not my father. They saw you. They know that the Earl of Shiring is a murderer. What if my allies in Kingsbridge were hurt? What then? Absolve my sins. <laughs> Only if you announce your loyalty to King Stephen. No! Stephen lost. He is weak. Bishop Henry will not approve of me giving absolution to a supporter of Empress Maud. Are you a man of the church or not? I am. Then do as you are told. And never defy me again. Is that understood? Yes, my bishop. One day we'll tell everyone everything about us, Ali. All of them. Maybe we should have told everyone while we still could. Maybe there would have been ways to make it last.
Oh no, they told me Jack was here. I won't run away. He deserves to know. <laughs> Jack! Oh, what is he doing in there? No. Jack! Jack. At least I still have my hair. Where can we go from here? Anywhere we want. What is this? I told you I had a surprise for you. Remember? This is it. What is it? It's a... a first version of a fulling mill. It's fulling the cloth all by itself using the motion of the water wheel. Yes. What do you think? You'll be able to sell even more cloth, not just wool, like you wanted to. It's... it's a brilliant invention. It's what I always wanted. Then why do you look so sad? Because there will not be another market. No, not in Kingsbridge. We will go someplace else then, where he won't find us. He will find me, wherever I go. You can't just give up. I'm not giving up. And I'm not running away. And because I'm not running away, there is something I have to tell you. It's not what I want to do. It's what I have to do. Is it? I'm getting married to support Richard. To whom? It's not important. William will burn down anything that I build up. This is the only choice I have. My husband will pay for Richard's expenses. It's the only way my brother can protect our people. I will marry you. I love you, Jack, and I always will, but look at yourself. You are a good man, Jack, and monks can't marry. 
Then I will stop being a monk. And what then? I don't know. It's not your fault. If I had money, I could support you. Oh, don't say that. There is only one man to blame. Who is it? What? Who are you going to marry? the houses he builds in Shiring and Winchester. And he is a master builder now. What? Dear Francis, once you asked me if I often think of our parents. I do, and I often think of the day they were killed, and of how Abbot Peter took us in. Peter raised us and taught us about God. We grew up in the safety of the monastery. Only now have I begun to understand that outside the private, the killing continued every single day. I have come to believe that if God existed, he would not allow all the pain and bloodshed. <sighs> A few days ago, William Hamley and his men attacked us. Many died by their hand. And among them is Milius. First, I believed I had brought the devil to Kingsbridge, for I thought I had seen him in Lincoln. The last few nights, I did not sleep. I was afraid that in my dreams I might flee from his grasp in blind terror toward the river and drown like Prior James did. But I know this is not the work of the devil but of man. But then, where is God? Most of what Abbot Peter taught us was wrong. Where is that loving God to protect us? But in one thing, he was absolutely right. For he taught us about living in seclusion, away from sin, away from want, away from the world that turns man against man. I know I blamed you for what happened after we got involved with Bishop Whalen. I do not anymore. But I blame our church and men like Waleran, because they involve themselves in the bloodshed. As Peter taught us, I will go into seclusion. The answers I seek are not out there. Maybe I will find them in here. Put that away! Stop it immediately! No! 